Diego through and through. I always say, Z, you see that? You see? San Diego oh, through and through. All day. It, it's much deeper. Padres fans showing how much they love the game. The team could end the series against the Braves tonight and move on to the next round of playoffs. Mike Coanker, Wally Eliu joining us live from Altitude Sky Lounge. We can hear the fans from here. Your top Kim, of the gas when we land. saw you at the top of the hour of 5 o'clock, I showed you the stadium. At that point, it was about 10% filled. Now you're seeing all the waving flags in the air. We're about 80% filled, and we're still about, I don't know, 8 10 minutes out from the first pitch. It's packed in the stadium. It's packed all through the gas lamp. It's packed even up here, 22 floors up as we're kind of overlooking the stadium, having a lot of fun. I'm going to get out to ABC 10 News reporter Spencer Sorcher, who has been with fans over the tailgate lot. Spencer, when we saw you earlier, you were with fans who said their bosses well, had to be a little bit nice, a little bit flexible with them off. It's 5.30 now, so they should have plenty of time. Yeah, Wally, we made our way over to 10th and K Street. You can see people are excited to be getting their way into Petco Park right now. These are the last couple fans that can make their way. Probably got off of work a little bit later, but we saw fans who were here from 12 o'clock on earlier today, tailgating in the tailgate lot out there. And then obviously you see all these people walking in right now. Can I get a go Padres? Go oh, Padres. Go Padres. The excitement in the crowd is building tonight. They can end it. One guy told me we need a little broom out here to get ready for the sweep. I don't know if it really counts as a sweep if you win two out of three, but hey, they're going for it tonight with Java Joe on the mound in a couple of minutes. We're live outside of Petco Park. I'm Spencer Soysher for ABC 10 News. Spencer, thank you. Well, for so many of the Friar faithful, the Padres are more than just baseball. It's a tradition that strengthens family bonds literally for generations. And that's how the Padres blogger Mark Bartlett got into baseball. He and his father used to root for the Padres together and attended games, that is, up until the pandemic when his father passed away. We first introduced you to Mark earlier this year after Tatis wore these cleats made from the digital version of his U.S. Army uniform with the Bartlett family name clearly visible. It was an extra special gesture that not only honored Mark, but also his father, who served in the Navy and was buried without military honors because of COVID. I caught up with Mark yesterday as he was heading into the game. He shared with me how the experience helped bring him closure. My dad would always take me to games, you know, and, and I just know that if he was here, he would be here holding his flag with me, rooting on our Padres. And, but I know he's up there again, you know, uh, with Papa Peter, I always say, um, I, I just, I just wish he was here, man. It's much more than baseball. Yeah. It's, uh, it's my dad serving in the military as well, in the Navy proudly for 24 years. It's me serving in the U.S. Army. It's our whole family dating back to World War One, POWs, and just serving country and be able to see the Bartlett name on a f cleats. For Tatis to do that, it gave closure during a time when you couldn't get closure for your dad because of COVID. Yeah. I lost my dad during COVID, and uh, it was hard, man. And we were supposed to go to a Padres game in Mexico City. We had bought the tickets. Uh, he was ready to go. He's never been on a road trip outside of San Diego to watch the Padres. Um, COVID hit, and then I lost my father during COVID. And uh, I never had closure, man. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. Hi there. But one small act from his favorite player meant the world, huh? With, with the name, the name on the cleats. It's my dad. It's the Padres. It's his service. That's what San Diego is. It's service. Service to the communities. Service to the country. And for a player, an athlete to do that, it's everything. So Tatis is forever embedded in my heart. Love that guy. And Mark tells me he has his dad's flag with him tonight in that very stadium as he cheers for the Padres with his own daughter. A lot of emotion tonight. I got to tell you, the game is just about to begin. Please stick with us for more 
Padres fun tonight. That is, of course, one of the emotions. Can really a lot of fun and excitement tonight as I throw my first pitch back to you in the studio. Okay, great story. And Mr. Bartlett, thank you for your service. So happy that he's on those shoes. Thank you, Wale.